Bella Hadid and art director Mark Coleman are officially dating, and we haven't been this excited for a new member of the Hadid family since the birth of baby Kai. It seems that Bella has found a new love. She looks very happy, and they even spent Valentine's Day together. But could this go beyond just a new relationship? Well, apparently, yes. And this is because sources close to the couple, and especially to Bella, have affirmed that this is much more serious than they've let on. You want to know all the details, so stay to find out. Let's do a little recap of Bella's love life, who, although famous and beautiful, has not had a long list of boyfriends. We already know about her acclaimed relationship with The Weeknd artist, Abel. But let's dig a little deeper. It's no secret that The Weeknd was Bella Hadid's most noteworthy romance during her time in the spotlight. After all, the A-list couple dated for over four years on and off. In addition, the Wasted Time singer has written several songs about her. Bella has, however, been linked to several other celebrities too, including NFL player Odell Beckham Jr. and Drake. According to Us Weekly, the 2C slide rapper threw the supermodel an extravagant 21st birthday party in October 2017. At the time, a source told the publication that Drake planned it and paid for everything. Furthermore, Drake released his album Scorpion in June 2018, and his song Finesse seemed to allude to a relationship with Bella. I want my baby to have your eyes. I'm going against my own advice. Should I do New York? I can't decide. Fashion week is more your thing than mine, he sang. I can't even lie. I'd rather stay inside. I can't do suit and tie. Can't be in a room with you and stand on different sides. Drake even acknowledged Bella's father in his song called Sandra's Rose. The stanza states, My house is full of supermodels, just like Mohammed Hadid. After a fan said she and Drake banged, the California native was quick to clarify her name. Not me, replied the model. Bella responded on Twitter, That's disrespectful. Why can't people be friends without all the insinuation? It didn't take long for the suspicion to fade away after that. Bella and The Weeknd were also 100% back together by October of that year, so much so that they dressed up as Beetlejuice and Lydia Dietz for Heidi Klum's famed Halloween party. Unfortunately, Bella and The Weeknd called it quits in August 2019. She's currently keeping herself busy, according to a source who spoke to Life & Style. The greatest healer is time. Bella has also been romantically linked to the Cleveland Browns whiteout on several occasions over the years. They had known each other before, but once she split from The Weeknd, Odell reached out instantly. BET reported in 2016, they really enjoy each other's company. Odell later wrote a romantic comment on Bella's Valentine's Day Instagram photo in February 2018. He added a winking face emoji and said, Valentine's Day alone, the best way. Fi and Bella Because of their close friendship, Fi and Bella are frequently mistaken for a couple, as are Fi and Kendall Jenner and Fi and Kourtney Kardashian. Bella and Jack Nicholson's grandson fueled dating rumors in October 2020. Her representatives, on the other hand, denied the relationship. Coming back to the weekend, the 25-year-old model has had an on-again, off-again relationship with a musician, but it looks like the New York-based star is enjoying her new relationship after making things Instagram official with Coleman in July 2021. Despite keeping their relationship relatively hidden in recent months, the model stunned admirers by sharing a series of photographs of herself and the art director on Instagram for Valentine's Day 2022. The posts came after the runway regular bravely opened up on the Victoria's Secret VS Voices podcast about her past of tough relationships. I grew up around me, whether that was in relationships or a family or whatever it was, where I was constantly told that my voice was less important than their voice, she said. Then moving into relationships growing up and not having the boundaries of being able to stick up for myself and have my voice be heard affected me in my adult relationships very intensely. My nervous system would crash. It was fight or flight. The art director and model have been photographed holding hands in New York City in recent weeks. Here's all you need to know about the couple's romance, including a timeline of events. What does Mark Kalman do for a living? For quite some time, Kalman has worked with the A-list cast. According to his website, the art director has worked with Kylie Jenner's ex-boyfriend Travis Scott and various fashion firms in recent years, including developing logo art for Made Fashion Week and working as a fashion assistant for magazines, such as The New York Times and T-Magazine. Kalman was described as a young Fabian Baron, Charles Saatchi and Steve Jobs all rolled into one by writer Perielle Aschenbrand in an interview with 1985. Well, what about social media? Is there a social media presence for Mark Kalman? Yes, Kalman has an Instagram account, but it's set to private, so don't expect to see any of his Hadid photos in your feed anytime soon. Bella Hadid posted romantic photographs of herself and Mark Kalman on Instagram in February 2022. 
Hadid used her Instagram story to share a series of romantic photos of herself and Kalman for Valentine's Day 2022. The photographs included one of her and Kalman curled up on the sofa with the words, to my bestie in a tessie, which seemed to be a homage to their budding affair. She captioned another photo of them at dining El Fresco, favorite dinner date, with a brief and sweet comment. There was also a snapshot of them holding hands and gazing into each other's eyes in astonishment. Kalman hugged a delighted Hadid from behind in a short video of them embracing in front of a mirror. Hadid made care to emphasize the significance of self-love in addition to honoring her relationship with her followers. The most important relationship is with herself, she wrote, before adding, Love shows up in so many forms, so if you're feeling left out today for any reason, here is a reminder that today may be Valentine's Day, but it's also just Monday. Bella Hadid tweeted a selfie of herself with a mystery man canoodling in July 2021. Hadid was seen looking loved up with a man in an Insta image leaked by the account at Peachy Pools, which many assume was Kalman. She's seen in the photo placing her arms around his neck and leaning in for a kiss. Before the picture, the couple looked to show that their relationship had progressed when Kalman attended Gigi Hadid's birthday party at her New York home in April. Before that, Bella Hadid and Mark Kalman were photographed enjoying lunch with another acquaintance in September 2020. In New York City, Hadid and Kalman were seen dining outside with another acquaintance. Hadid had her hair up in a disheveled ponytail and wore a muted sweater for the low-key event. She completed her ensemble with her signature dark retro shades. Kalman was dressed similarly casually in a white t-shirt and dark pants. Bella Hadid and Mark Kalman were photographed leaving a cafe together in Midtown Manhattan in July 2020. Hadid and Kalman were first seen together in the summer of 2020, with their first photo taken together on July 2, 2020, when they were photographed exiting a cafe in downtown Manhattan. Kalman was photographed close behind Hadid at the moment. According to Page Six, the couple allegedly began dating in the same month but snuck around together in New York when there were fewer public events and travel due to the pandemic. They hit it well, a source told the news outlet, adding that they made an effort to ensure they weren't spotted together by paparazzi. The source explained, If they went out, he would come out first, get the car, and then she would get into the car. They would drive to a location and he'd drop her off but not get out and go park the car. They were very diligent about not being seen on a public street at the same time. According to the insider, when the couple did go out together, they made sure there was never any PDA. Apparently, Bella is immensely happy with her new relationship, and although it is relatively recent, it seems that all that love is consummating because close sources have assured that the couple is thinking about getting tied up for life. And well, what better way to do it than getting married? Can you imagine Bella Hadid's wedding? Will Yolanda now let her daughter be and be with whoever she wants? After all this information, we want to know your opinion. What do you think are the true expectations of this relationship? Do you really think they will get married? Leave all your comments and theories below, and do not forget to subscribe to the channel so you get posted on all the new gossip from your favorite celebrities. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching!